Hard Chat. Welcome to Hard Chat. I'm joined by Bachelorette Sophie Monk. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for having me again. I don't know why I'm back here for this punishment. Let's chat hard. Okay. Again. I got it. Say cool. Last time you were on Hard Chat, we yeah. joked about you being the Bachelorette. Yes. Because it was a ridiculous idea. Well, yes. Which made Channel 10 think it was a good idea. <laughs> How much money does Channel 10 owe me? Oh. Well, it actually it didn't come from you, no offence. That was a joke and then I really thought about it a few days later. So I can't give you the credit there. Well, there were two of us in that meeting. <laughs> I would were call you... that a brainstorm. Okay. And with the two of us, so what do, what I do think you... on the brains ledger, <laughs> I might have contributed rather heavily. Do you think... Do, do I owe you something? Yeah, I think Channel 10 owes, owes me something. Your money or...? Yeah, just a cash. Job. What other ideas could we put on the table? Because if we say it here, it becomes reality. What are you thinking? I'm thinking maybe you could host the 7.30 report. Oh, I can't read. Look, I swear I can't. I'd just like to see you interview the Prime Minister. I think it'd be very entertaining. I'd love to if I knew something about politics. Yeah, you'd have to know who the Prime Minister was. <laughs> I like Bill Short and he's a friend of mine. Is he? Yeah. He oh. follows me on Instagram and likes my photos. OK. He's quite cool. You reckon? Mm. Do you, do you like the way he destroys other Prime Ministers? I don't know much about what he does. He's just nice to me. <laughs> Is that all it takes? Yeah. And it's just cool to say, you know, you're friends with a politician, really, isn't it? Well, I feel like it gives me credibility. A lot of people go, she knows what she's doing. No. I think getting you credibility is very tricky at this stage. <laughs> yeah. Do you need it nowadays, though? Well, I think you've proved that you don't. <laughs> Australia fell in love with you during The Bachelorette. Was it good that someone fell in love during the series? <laughs> I did fall in love. We just live, you know, in different states, so we're not posting it all over the place because I'm just not that person. Right. Yeah. OK, so you're not... So you're not gushy? No. OK. Do you like that? I don't like PDA. Yeah, I don't. I haven't kissed my wife for ten years. For that reason. That's a whole different set of problems, I think. Yeah. yeah. What's more fake, your relationship with Stu or your face? Oh, my God, that's so mean! Um, uh, but it's, good question. That's the whole point of the second. OK, thanks. Yeah. Um, well, neither's fake. Yeah, I think all the media are just like going us. I can't. I have to honestly Google through everything and go. Oh, we're together. We're broken up. It changes every day. I was pregnant with twins the other day. Well, are you pregnant with twins? No, he's okay. been dissexed or whatever it's called. <laughs> okay. Okay. Have you checked you downstairs yourself? I'd. It'd be a bit weird if I didn't, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm all over it. Not meaning I'm, I'm all over. <laughs> I mean, I'm all over. The, yeah, the situation. We're good. The last hard chat we did went viral. Yes. Were any of the bachelors a bit viral? No, they all get tested. I got tested. <laughs> I was sitting there going, oh, holy crap, I was coming back. Imagine I had to get out of it because I had a herpes or something. Luckily, we're all clear. I keep getting told that I look like Jared. Oh. So when you rejected him, were you rejecting me? Yeah, but look how far he went. So was that saying something? He's into landscaping. Yeah. Um, I'm yeah. into manscaping. Oh. We've got a lot in common. Oh, do, how much hair have you got? You, it's not like... No, no, it's not, not your thing, is it? No, well, you don't, you don't lose hair upstairs and downstairs at the same time. That'd be weird. Do you gain more downstairs? Yeah, you do. Really? I've got a nipple hair that just won't stop growing. <laughs> I've got pluck it to me. And I've called it Trevor, because it's just part of me now. And it, I pluck it, and the next minute it's back. And I feel yeah. like people should study that for male, male pattern baldness. Mm. Has Trevor ever gotten longer? But, uh, yeah, I think he might have gained a friend. That's a bit depressing. Oh. So Trent's on there too. Tre yeah. <laughs> Trevor and Trent. All right, thanks for chatting. Hard! Thanks for having me.